An accused of posing as a rideshare driver to attack a woman. Police arrested the man after putting him under surveillance. Well, tonight, many rideshare customers say this case is making them more vigilant when getting into strangers' cars. CBS 2's Rachel Kim is live at the Beverly Hills Police Department with more information for us. Rachel. Well, Pat and Rick, Beverly Hills Police here say the suspect has been charged with rape, kidnapping, and other felonies. They want to get the word out about this arrest because they believe he may be responsible for other attacks across LA County. With so many places to shop, eat, and see along the busy streets of West Hollywood, a lot of people choose to get around with ride sharing services. But one woman who made a call ended up becoming a sexual assault victim. It's definitely quite scary because, I mean, it's, you know, you're just getting into random cars. Beverly Hills police say on May 13th, a female passenger got into the car of 40 year old Carlos Omar Pachente. Investigators believe he posed as an Uber driver when he picked her up in West Hollywood. They say Pachente then drove a short distance and pulled over in Beverly Hills, where he sexually assaulted her. I actually don't do it by myself anymore. I only do it if my husband's with me because of all the stuff that's been going on. Because it's kind of crazy. A week after the attack, detectives conducted surveillance on Pacente and soon identified him as the suspect. They arrested him for rape. Here's the car police say he was driving a silver 2015 four door Kia Rio. It had decals from both Uber and Lyft, even though he is not an employee of either service. Customers we spoke with say an assault like this is a wake up call. You have to match up the license plate to who you're actually calling. But I've actually seen where people just will walk towards it because it looks like an Uber and it's scary. I mean, so many times I'm guilty of it. Looking on my phone, talking to somebody on the phone when I'm in the Uber, like, I don't know if they're driving out of my way. Beverly Hills police believe Pachente may have been involved in other sexual assaults in the LA area. They now want to know if there are other victims. You always have to be on guard. If you have information about this case or if you believe you were a victim, please call Beverly Hills Police. The suspect, Pachente, has pleaded not guilty to all charges. Back to you in the studio.